54th in the field. It'll be 12th row outside, currently second in points with the West Coast Series. In the number nine entry from Snohomish, the ProFab Motorsports, Dalton's Midway Auto Service, Meta Supermarkets of Everett, Maxim Chassis, Burt Johnson. To his inside, starting in 23rd, it's the Spires Jackson Racing sponsored entry. The Spires Construction, Bardall Lubricants and Additives, Speed Martin Incorporated, John Irby Landscaping, The Cart Shop, Giesler's Auto Repair, Diablo Chassis, the youngest driver in the field out of Adrian, Oregon, Aiden Spires. <laughs> to the driver that will start 22nd, he enters this weekend 14th in Royal Purple NSRA Wing Sprint Car Points out of Elmira, Oregon. The Holt Drilling Tools, number 32, Stealth Chassis, was 20th in this race last year. Mitch Holt. Starting in 21st, the winner of your B Main. He has one win already this season. That was at South Sound Speedway with the Super Sprints. He is currently 10th in NSRA points out of Redmond, the Geico Insurance, RJD Construction, First Line Systems, Eagle Chassis, the defending West Coast Series champion, Randy Dubois. Starting in 20th with the impressive win at the Rick Brown Super Show to kick things off for the 2017 campaign with the Royal Purple and SRA Wing Sprint Cars. He is the second generation driver out of Winston, Oregon. Pardon me, third generation driver out of Winston, Oregon. And the Art Hope Own, number 33, the car based out of Veneta, Oregon. The Holt Drilling Tools Stealth Chassis, second in an SRA points. He also has a victory at South Sound Speedway. That was back early in the year in April. It is Kyle Alberting. And Kyle Alberting, 17th at this race last year. Randy Dubois was 10th. Starting row number 10, inside, in 19th place, the number 57. It's the legend from Edmonds, the Westlake Commercial Property, Signature Texturing, Fleet Services, Truck and Auto Repair, American Music, Beast Chassis. It is the 1984, 1985, 1991, and 1992 Skagit Speedway 410 Sprint Car Champion. Let's welcome back Billy Kennelly. <laughs> Billy Kennelly will start in 19th, starting 18th. It's the kid from Langley, British Columbia, Canada, fifth in points headed into tonight. The two-time Agassiz Midget Speedway, Agassiz Speedway Midget Champion, former Mini Stock Nationals winner at Spokane, Serious Performance Race Engines, Kick Cookies Horse Treats, Valiant Sign Painting, Stealth Chassis, that is Aaron Wilson. Starting 17th from the Redmond area. Westlake Commercial Property, Signature Texturing, Fleet Services, Truck and Auto Repair, American Music, number three, Beast Chassis, sixth in series points, headed into the night. He was 21st last year at the RPM. Robert Beck. The driver who will start 16th is a former Pepsi Sprint champion at Meridian Speedway. He's won the Diamond Cup, two-time Western Wing Sprint car champion, and twice the victor at the Sportsman Classic at Meridian in the Spires Jackson Racing, number 25, J. Diablo Chassis, the Spires Construction, Bardaw Lubricants and Additives, Speed Martin Incorporated, John Irby Landscaping, the Cart Shop, Giesler's Auto Repair Machine from Meridian, Idaho, Johnny Giesler. Johnny Giesler, two main event wins already this season at Rocky Mountain Raceways in Salt Lake City. 
Utah. To the driver starting in the inside of him, in the number 14, or starting position number 15, this team with Robbie Price driving last year finished 14th at this race. The Connors, Rod and Gord Rendell, the car from Victoria, British Columbia, Canada, the driver also from Meridian, Idaho, Shark Racing Engines, RBR Motorsports, Taylor Metalcraft, Milstow Heating and Sheet Metal, Beast Chassis, Trevor Moran. Starting 14th in the number eight car, 22nd at this event last season, the YMC Heating and Cooling, Bardaw Lubricants and Additives, Hurricane Chassis Racing for car owners, Joey and Sarah Moore, the car from Boise, Idaho, the driver out of Adrian, Oregon. He's fourth in Royal Purple NSRA Wing Sprint Car Points. He is also second in the local standings at Meridian Speedway. In the number eight, that is Tristan Spires. Starting in 13th place, this man needs no introduction, but we'll give it to him anyways, from Vancouver Island, from the gorgeous and scenic city of Langford, British Columbia, the Malahat Metal Company, Draycore Construction, Integra Tire, Lord Co. Racing, Ganey Brothers, Howie's Car Corral, Maxon Insurance, a &A Performance Chassis, the five-time and defending Real Rock Series champ, winner of the NSRA Championship in 2006, the recently crowned Wing Super Sprint champ at Western Speedway, and a three-time winner of the prestigious Daffodil Cup. He has never won this race, despite that impressive resume. We'll see if he can do it tonight. He starts 13th for 33J, Jeff Montgomery. The driver that starts 12th, a similarly impressive resume. The four-time NSRA Sprint Champion, he's the current point leader, four-time Douglas County Speedway Sprint Car Champ, twice a winner of the Rebel Jackson Memorial. He's won the Diamond Cup, the Daffodil Cup, the Super Shoe, and the Sportsman Classic, but never this race. He pilots the Rockman Now Sal, Davidson Auto Parts, WSK Machine, Sign Factory, Oregon Tool and Supply, Roseburg and Coos Bay, number 76 piece chassis from Winston, Oregon, is tonight the night for Andy Alberting. Starting in 11th, with a large contingent of fans in the house tonight, out of Edmonds, He's third in points at South Sound Speedway in the Super Sprint Division. The NIC, Global Manufacturing Solutions, k t Machine, Woodenville Import Auto Repair, Fleet Services Truck and Auto Repair, Randy Can Portable Restrooms, Cactus Moon Saloon, AA Plumbing, Eagle Chassis, the 41R, Thomas Richardson. Starting in 10th in the number 12 car. He was seventh at this race last year, second in King of the Wing points last season. He's won the Daffodil Cup at Western Speedway in the Royal Purple Lubricants, Maxwell Trucking, Corny Buchert Enterprises, Steel Chassis from Quill, British Columbia, Canada, in the scenic and majestic Rocky Mountains. That is Ron Larson. Ron Larson will start in 10th. The driver that will start 9th, the number 44 car out of Linwood. The Cascade Collision, Fleet Services Truck and Auto Repair, Todd Co. Motorsports Machine. He is the current point leader at South Sound Speedway, where he has one local victory on June 10th. That is Todd Coleman. Starting in 8th. It is the one T. He won the first night of the Diamond Cup at Meridian Speedway, the most winningest non-wing sprint car driver when it comes to the Pacific Northwest. He's a former track champion at Sunset Speedway Park, multi-time Intermountain Series champion, also a former champion with the Oregon Double Shot Series, the Hurst Precision Parts, Wolverine Chassis, number one T, out of Mill City, Oregon, Tony Thomas. Tony Thomas enters this race ninth in points. He was ninth at this race last year. The driver that will start seventh is the number 28, the young man from Meridian, Idaho, 
who is the defending NASCAR modified champion at Meridian Speedway and the current point leader when it comes to sprint cars. He is eighth in series points and fifth in local standings at Meridian Speedway. He drives the Integrity Pools. Now could be racing Bare Bones Training, Big Daddy's Barbecue, Premier Mortgage with Julie Hart, Beast Chassis. That is Colton Nelson. As we get closer towards the front of the field, the number four car that will start sixth when the green flag drops. It's the Fleet Services Truck and Auto Repair, Mendendorf Motorsports, number four, Beast Chassis. He is second in the local standings at South Sound Speedway. And Tolino from Snohomish, that is Greg Mendendorf. Starting in fifth, it's going to be the 12 in from Everett, the Fleet Services, Truck and Auto Repair, Chandler Reach Vineyards, Winville Import Auto Repair, Property Inspector Home Inspections, Johansson Mechanical, Brostrom Racing, Bennett Family Racing, Overture Photography, Snap-on Tools, Diablo Chassis, two big wins just a couple weeks ago, sweeping the weekend with Wesco at the Wenatchee Valley Super Oval. It's the 12 in of Cameron Neisinger. <laughs> Starting in fourth place, it's going to be the zero out of Olympia, the McLeese Automotive. Davlin Auto Upholstery Rocket Chassis, the former Wesco Restricted Series champ, currently fifth in local points at South Sound Speedway, Garrett McLeese. Starting third, the current point leader with the Wesco Series. He has one win already this season. That was at Wenatchee Valley Super Bowl on May 20th. The Royal Purple Lubricants of Arrows, Auto Sales, Seattle Printworks, Central Coast Airbrush. Special thanks to Speed Mart Incorporated and Highline Performance utilizing a stealth chassis from East Wenatchee, Tim Holiday. And that'll bring us to our front row starting positions on the outside pole, 16th at this event last year from Colville in the CS Fabrics, Kerry's Auto Body, National Coating and Supplies of Spokane, Ron Pryor Pro Automotive, number 65 car, second in West Coast points last year, Rookie of the Year with the NSRA Series in 2015, that is Levi Rose. And last but not least, racing the Eddie Isaacson number one, the car from Fall City, this team, the defending West Coast Sprint Series championship winners, the driver row from Granite Falls, the 1999 Will Rock West Coast Challenge winner, Isaacson Dozing, Performance Coatings, Racing Rewards, Racing Radios, King Racing Products, Stealth Chassis, and your pull sitter tight when the green flag drops, Jason Thomas. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is your starting lineup for your 40 lap feature for the 2017 Rory Price Memorial here at Evergreen Speedway. And race fans, as we get set to start our main event feature of the evening, of course, there's racing taking place, but this race is 
named in honor of a dear friend of ours who unfortunately we lost, the one, the only, Rory Price. This race is run in honor of him, who, and he competed in dirt and pavement sprint cars, 410s or 360s, both winged and non-winged, and even midgets. He was tragically lost during non-winged sprint car test at uh, Evergreen Speedway in March of 2006. There's been a race ran in his honor every year since his passing. During his driving tenure, he piloted race cars for well-known sprint car owners such as Will Kennedy, Kelly Kane, Roy Rasmussen, and Gordy Sirwald, to mention a few. And there has been 11 races, five different winners. Matt Hine has won the last six, going as far back as 2011. This race has never rained out. 2006, the first edition, Craig Deaver the winner, Jake Mann winning in 2007, Matt Hine winning his first in 2008, Drew Church 2009, Randy Bauer 2010, and then 2011 on, it was all Matt Hine. So tonight, what is guaranteed is there will be a first time winner of the Rory Price Memorial, and it will go down 